All right, and we are back. This is episode seven of my Pokemon Blue Nuzlocke Challenge. In the last episode, we started venturing into Mount Moon, and we are going to pick up exactly where we left off. All right. So off screen, I ran back to the Poke Center, and I healed up real quick, and then I got right back to here to start for you guys. All right, so let's continue heading down south here and see what we got. I know there's a trainer right there. Still just as many Zubats as there was in the last episode. I'm heal up G-Rock here real quick because he took some damage in that last encounter. Okay. Um. I want to say that's a scientist or a pokey nerd. I'm not too sure. I don't exactly remember. Uh. We'll, we'll put Silky in front. We'll see how this goes. Okay. Super nerd, alright. Oh. I should have thought about this better. I want to say that Magnemite has Thundershock. Um switch real quick. We'll put G-Rock out. Er, rock. Yeah, rock. <clears throat> still, still can't believe I got a Geodude as my Mount Moon encounter. It's, it's pretty awesome. So we're just gonna be in a tactical spam war here. Keep going back and forth. So how is everybody doing? Okay. So I'm, I'm hoping to record enough content tonight all, all through Mount Moon and, and a bit more so I can just start hammering out and uh, getting a bunch more of this edited to put out for you guys. That's what I'm hoping for. <laughs> we'll, we'll see if it gets, gets, gets as far as I uh, as I planned on. Oh, Silky grew to level 14. Awesome. And Grok grew to level 9. Voltorb. Okay, we're just going to leave Grok in there. Should have no problem with this. Let's keep on spamming that tackle. Hmm. Uh, should be okay. That bulldog's gonna need a lot more than just one screech to really do more, more than a couple points of damage to us. <laughs> so it uses another one. Seems like every time I say say something, that's that's when they start doing it. <laughs> Alright, and then that is another win in the bag. And Grok grew to level 11. And learned Defense Curl. Okay. I think we grew two levels there, actually. Alright. So let's, uh, Silky back. Put Spear Peck up front. Check this item out. And we got ourselves another potion. Okay. Item here to pick up. Alright, and this item, rare candy. Okay, I think. Hmm, I'm not too sure. I'm gonna hold on to that rare candy for now, but I might just end up selling that as well. And let's see what this trainer has to offer us. It's a bug catcher. Okay, looks like Spirit Peck is just going to get uh, some easy experience points here. Works for me. And one hit KO.
don't know if we even want to KO its Metapod, though. Let's see. <laughs> almost, almost. Did some good damage there. It's only a level 10 Metapod, though, which brings up another question. Why didn't you evolve your Metapod? Why? And Caterpie, some more quick, easy experience points. Another one hit KO. Awesome. Okay. So I think, yeah. All right. Spirit Peck just grouped level 14 there, and so many zoo bats. So many Zubats. There's still another item, a escape rope. Maybe I should have saved the money and not bought that second one. Okay, awesome. Alright. Uh, I don't remember what this trainer has, but let's... Okay, let's move her Tastic up. Let's see what this trainer's got. Okay, an Oddish. You should be able to, to win this. It did a little bit more damage to me than I was hoping it would. It's okay. I'm gonna spam a couple more quick attacks. Ooh. Maybe not. Let's, uh, let's switch out. Uh, yeah, we'll put Silky in. Confusion. Hmm, another confusion. Fantastic Root of level 13. I'm about to send out Bell Sprout. Okay. Um, now let's keep Silky in. Do some more confusions. And another one down. Check out the party. Oh, put Mausitz up front for now. Explore a little bit more. <laughs> oh, I'll be so happy once I get out of this cave. I swear, I just, just had three Zubats in a row, just like that. Every two, three steps, a Zubat. Another two, three steps, another Zubat. Yeah. Easy EXP. Easy EXP. It's, that's how I'm going to look at it, is easy EXP. And more editing to do. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> okay, let's see. Um we should be okay, we'll go down this ladder. Check out this area real quick. And that is another team rocket grunt. And a Rataman wants to learn hyperfang. What move to get rid of? We'll get rid of... We'll, we'll get rid of Tail Whip. For sure. We are not going to need that move. So let's grab this item. TM1. Forget what item that is. 
is Mega Punch. Who can learn that? Uh, Grok can learn that, actually. I think I'm going to hold off on that for now. Just to kind of wait and see. So let's, uh, let's go take on this Team Rocket grunt here. Okay. Hey, Zubats. Not like I haven't fought enough of these things already. Alright. So now Zits just keep spamming some quick attack. Ekans, uh, Mazit should be able to take down the seconds, no problem. Okay, so one more. And that is another victory. Mazit screwed to level 14. And a mouse that's learned Hyper Fang. Alright, and then this should be a hidden item. A ether. And that will restore some uh, power points to uh, Pokemon's moves. Ooh, how are we looking? Um, okay, actually starting to get to that point and... And pretty far into the video so what I'm going to do is I'm going to stop the video here I'm going to use an escape rope I'm going to go heal up then I'm going to come right on back to here and we'll take it from here in the next episode till then bye